by fighting those bolts, that one and that one, and they both took some, I was able to turn them a little bit. And I'm hoping that was enough to kind of seal that gap, but we shall find out. I've uh, cleaned this area again. And we're looking at this corner right here. And obviously when I shut it off, right there. So right now it's been running. And... Uh, I'm gonna shut it off and see what happens. Cause last time I literally I shut it off, and within five minutes, it was uh, it was leaking. So let's see what happens. That bolt was wet. That's just residual from me cleaning the other stuff. That's not our area of interest. This is uh, this is the area of interest. And uh, that over there, that bolt. So, will it leak again? Will that bolt get covered in oil again? a five six minutes video but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do and if this is fixed then these will be the best five minutes you've spent on this car. I'm gonna start it up again. I'm going to shut it off again. Four minute mark. Give it another minute. And uh, see what happens. Last time, literally, I shut it off, and within five minutes, it started dripping. So this is looking very, very good to me. Yeah, the fact that that bolt is still dry. Coming out. 
That is excellent. All right, we're past the five minute mark for this video. I'm going to shut it off here and I will continue to watch it, start it and run it and maybe take it for a drive around the block and it, if it stays dry then I think this is a closed chapter at least for for the time being. Huh? One last one last peek at the power steering while we're here. That's looking good. That's looking good as well. And so is this thing. I think that was it. But we'll see. I'm gonna I'm gonna watch it some more and uh, see what happens.